Welcome to this channel. In this video, I will show you exactly why you get the problem such as ad can't run, website URL doesn't comply, or you see non-functional landing page. Ads must not direct people to a functional to non-functional landing pages. This includes landing page content that interferes with a person's ability to navigate away from the page. And then um, when they say that, this is exactly what they mean. They mean that you shouldn't be using a landing page like this with several pop-ups and as you can see you just it will, you click and it is asking you it congratulating you asking you to go to certain web pages trying to open a lot of pop-ups that you that are unnecessary that you didn't even into it doesn't even relate to what the advert is about this is a non-functional landing page that is this is a perfect example then another perfect example of non-functional landing pages a landing page that is not functioning. When you click on the link, it does not open to where it is supposed to even open to. And I want to show you um, the policy itself from Facebook and what they say about non-functional landing page before we continue about how to solve it. So when you come to um, Facebook own website, this is what they say about non-functional landing page. Ads must not direct people to non-functional landing pages, destination pages. This include page content that interferes with a person's ability to navigate. Then when you go down, it gives you more guidelines on what must be accepted and what is not. A link is that when running ads that direct people to landing page, advertisers will need to make sure that it is accessible. This means link is fully functional and doesn't lead people to a page still under construction or an error page. Landing page functions properly and can be accessed by meta ad review regardless of any geographic IP address. Landing page does not have any warnings about security of the site. Landing page doesn't require someone to download unexpected program or software access to access content. Landing page cannot be a PDF or a JPEG file. So that is what they mean by non-functional landing page. Then you can see all these additional guidelines. Now, the problem here is there are a lot of instances where what they are saying doesn't even relate. You Your landing page doesn't even have any problem relating to what they are even talking about. And I have experienced it myself. So for example, I'm trying to run an advert. I might like, I'm, I'm even I'm running a messenger or WhatsApp advert and they are still giving me that warning. So how do you solve that? This is how to solve it. For those of you who use your Instagram account uh, profile link, as the website, it is not it's supposed to be that way. Don't if you do that, you may get this non-functional landing page because if they are if people click on it, if you are using the link, it will open like a web browser before you can go and access the content, and they may see that as a non-functional landing page. Some of you too, you are using a, a, a personal Instagram profile, and 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 instead of using a business profile. So if you are using a personal profile, the link is not accessible, and you may get that problem. You see, so um, some of you too, you may also be running an advert that direct to WhatsApp and instead of choosing, selecting send, uh, send WhatsApp message and the, the WhatsApp button, you decide to rather use the WhatsApp link as a website and say they should, uh, like you are driving traffic to a website and the link is WhatsApp link. It may give you this problem. So you have to so make sure that if it is a WhatsApp, you strictly select the WhatsApp button. If it's Messenger, you select the Messenger button. If you want to use uh, Instagram, if you want, don't select website if you don't actually have a website. Um, If you want people to go to your profile, you select, if it's on Instagram, select profile visit. That is what you're supposed to do. When you follow all these, you're supposed to get your issue resolved. When you follow this and you still don't get your issue resolved, please leave your comments in the comment section. You can also um, WhatsApp me by following the WhatsApp link and the Telegram link in the description of this video and I will help you get a solution to this problem. Once again, thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell and like this video for other more powerful videos like this. Once again, see you in the next video.